So like in several of the previous labs, our goal here is to build one big analysis workbook where you collect all of your data and do all of your analysis in one workbook and use references all the way through to, to run everything. In this particular case, our workbook is gonna look something like this. In this case, this is what our workbook is gonna look like. You can see that we're gonna have different sheets for the different stages of our analysis, just like we did before. And the very first step in this whole series of analysis is determining how many trials we're gonna do. So remember that a trial is a fixed number of oscillations. So say five, one, two, three, four, five. And that's a trial. And we could then determine that total time, divide by five and get the period of a single oscillation. So hopefully by now you've gone and sort of determined a good number of oscillations to work with by doing some basic observations of your pendulum. And you're gonna go through and determine the number of trials that you should do using the running average method we talked about in a previous lab. And this is gonna be the first sheet in your workbook.